Hey guys, welcome to a new video, friend Dushik here. Today we're gonna talk about some components from the PC. This is the Pentium 2 PC and this is a Pentium 2 processor from the slot card because uh, this, this type of the processor you can find on the slot card in Pentium 2 PCs, okay? And uh, today we talk about uh, gold in this type on, of the processor. Uh, some of you, uh, the people who are new in the gold recovery hobby or business, when see this type of the processor, basically no gold there. So you see that just you got some heatsink, some tin ball, no pins and uh, the plastic middle. But this type of the processor contain a very cool and very solid amount of hidden gold inside. We got fiber, we got plastic part, with silicon dye, we got heatsink. But when you separate all the parts from that processor, you will get these, okay? So, when you remove the heatsink, you got a very cool copper here, copper heatsink, see that? And if you got a lot of amount of this processor, you can have a big, big amount of copper. Uh, this is just nickel plating over the top, but inside is a pure copper. The second part is a layer which contain a heatsink and a processor on this part. This part, okay? So basically this look just like that, okay? So when you remove that other part, this is a gold plating. Even on the edge, under that thin, under that uh, thin silver solder, because this is a thin silver solder, you have a very nice gold brazing. You see that? Very nice color. Pretty cool. And it's very easily for a recovery. You can do that with a reverse electroplating or just in the AP. AP will remove every extra metal and leave you with the gold foils. See that? Very cool and very thick gold plating. Okay. Uh, the third part is uh, the body and you see the body of the processor inside when where you have this plastic center you have a uh, gold very cool gold i try to zoom it you see that all the all these traces around is a uh, gold and very very quality gold this is not gold bonding wire this is just a gold plating but if you have solid amount you can have a solid amount of gold very cool and the fourth part i crushed that because it's very hard for removing this is the middle the center with the plastic this is the actually a chip the main main part of chip and inside that plastic you have a gold you have a silicon die like on this side and you have a gold bonding wire. This is the basically microchip and like every other microchip contain gold bonding wire. And uh, this gold bonding wire is much better than normal chip. It's uh, not like BGA, but similar like BGA. Uh, basically a uh, microchip, which most similar to this type of chip is a sound chip from the PCs this kind of microchip with a four side lag it's very cool very good for uh, gold recovery got bone, gold bonding wire around the silicon die and uh, see that so this type of chip this type of chip is uh, pretty similar with this one uh, maybe even a better okay so once again, what we have, we have 
copper and we have a gold on the free place in this type of the processor. We got gold inside the fiber, very good gold. We got gold under the heatsink and we had gold bonding, pure gold bonding wire in the middle of the chip, okay? So right now I just want to show you how to separate all this part for and prepare it for recovery, okay? Let's start. Okay guys, so right now we have separate all the part for uh, processing this kind of the processor. So this is just a waste. You can have to try to remove some silver. Uh, this is just a worthless amount of silver from this tin ball. Or you can just try to recover that uh, tin. But tin is uh, cheap. You got your copper. This is just a copper heatsink. Uh, with a nickel plating, of course, and you got this braze. This is very solid gold here, very cool, you see by the color. And you have this middle part. This is just you can try to recover straight this stuff to Aqua Regia, no more tin there. So you can go that straight to Aqua Regia because with the AP it's very hard to remove that small flakes of gold, okay? Just solid amount of this, put in Aqua Regia and recover dirty gold, then re find that and it's very easily basically. And the most important part is uh, the middle of the processor, plastic center with the silicon die. This is your main gold bonding wire inside. So this stuff you can add with a BGA or some other type of the microchip and uh, with the same process which you basically do you can recover that okay but it's much better if you have a separate only this type of the microchip and uh, recover that separately okay so guys this is just a normal video by introducing some uh, different components and uh, I hope you like that if you don't already subscribe to my channel and of course hit that notification button support my channel you have different way to do that down in the description and i will see you in the next video for a few days okay guys see you around the out hey guys what's up friend here uh, welcome to the short video uh, Cherry season start and right now I am under the tree you see that the Cherry is beautiful 
so in the next days I will not be active on the YouTube channel the, after that I already prepared some material to show you but for now I need uh, done with my beautiful cherries you see that excellent so see you around friend of